Hi everyone, today we are going to see how we can create an AWS account and uh, start using the services. So we will go to the AWS official website and uh, we will go to the top right and we will click on create an AWS account. So we will be redirected to this page and here you need to enter the details so you need to set the password and uh, set an AWS account name it could be any name that you would want to uh, click on continue now you need to choose the account type since we are uh, new to AWS we will go for personal uh, enter the details uh, select the country uh, fill the rest of the details and uh, check this uh, checkbox then yeah so up uh, then you will be redirected to this page so in AWS you have something called free tire limit so s till the time you use the AWS resources up uh, uh, below the free tire limit or uh, up till the free tire limit you won't be charged any money but once you use the resources beyond the free tire limit you will be uh, charged some money by the AWS so you need to enter the card details here so it is going to charge you two rupees mm -hmm. and anyways uh, the two rupees would be refunded to you after your card gets validated so after filling the details so do you have a pan no you can click on this button now you will be getting a verification code to your phone number and you need to enter the otp click submit in order to confirm your identity it's going to ask for your phone number again enter the verification code here so your identity has been verified successfully continue since we are beginners we will choose the basic plan and it is actually recommended for new users just getting started with AWS so basic plan is free so here you can choose uh, any role as of now and submit click submit now we will sign into the console okay so now since we have created the account we can enter uh, the account uh, credentials so we will choose root user because we are the one who have created the account so enter the details click on sign in now you are into the AWS console so this is how the console looks like you can use any service you want so let's see EC2 so it is going to take some time uh, for your account to get activated so after this you can go to Gmail and uh, you will get a mail from AWS and here it says to access your account click access account okay now 
now we can use the services as required so this is how the console looks like and you can choose amongst tons of services that you would like to use now you have access to each and every service okay so that's pretty much it for this video i hope you like this video and uh, start practicing aws it will be fun Thank you.